You know, this weekend's weather looks so <laughs> nice. I just want to like frolic in a meadow. Is that weird? Can I say that? I want to yeah, frolic. Look, you can say weird. that. Uh, meteorologist <laughs> Stacey Donaldson, I'm planning on uh, maybe calling out this weekend because of how nice it's going to be. <laughs> no, so if you don't see oh, me, no, I'm going to no. be outside, okay? Shame on you, but it is going to be beautiful this weekend, whether you're frolicking or not. We're going to have lots of sunshine as we have clear skies across the metro area tonight and up in Boulder. A lot of folks out and about this evening. It's a nice, quiet night. This is what it looks like at Glenwood. Nice, clear skies overhead. Our observed highs today in the 60s, 63 degrees at DIA. We mostly had 50s up into northeastern Colorado and then 70s out toward Grand Junction today. But those 50s and 60s even in the higher elevations this afternoon. So warm statewide. Our average afternoon high. Is 59 degrees here in Denver and we were uh, just a little bit above that but as we get into the weekend we'll be closer to our record afternoon highs that will be in the 70s. Tomorrow morning we'll start out with 47 degrees at 7 a.m. and we'll be back into the mid 60s by 11 a.m. and we're headed into the 70s tomorrow so it'll be a warm dry weekend. Temperatures near 80 as we get through especially Sunday and Monday and then our next storm arrives into Tuesday and it'll bring in some chances for rain and snow across Colorado. Also the winds have really died down as well. Not quite as windy here across Colorado. We have winds between 5 and 15 miles an hour and that'll be the case in through the rest of tonight. Uh, we're not expecting overly windy conditions this weekend, but nice warm temperatures. Right now it's in the 40s and 50s here for the eastern half of the state. Still some 60s out toward Montrose, 46 in Telluride and 59 for Durango. Along the I-25 corridor we mostly have 50s, still 63 at Chatfield and then we have 55 for Broomfield. Our satellite radar picture very quiet tonight. Some high clouds off to our north. Otherwise, tonight we'll have partly cloudy skies, 39 for our overnight low, and we'll have those temperatures in the 30s here for the front range in the plains as you wake up tomorrow morning, 20s and 30s down through southwestern Colorado. 38 downtown for tomorrow morning. We'll have 45 at Chatfield or for Highlands Ranch, 42 for Deckers and 41 for Parker with 30s up toward Fort Collins and Greeley. And the wake up forecast in the 40s and 50s early on. Then we're in the upper 60s by noon, 77 degrees for a high expected tomorrow afternoon. It'll be warm and dry. 70s here and then 80s farther to the south. We'll have 50s and 60s for the higher elevations and 70s toward Cortez and Durango. Highs right around Denver, mid to upper 70s. It'll be a beautiful day. We'll have 70s up to northeastern Colorado, dropping a little bit out towards Sterling with a high of 65. We'll have 50s off to the west into the foothills and not much on our extended future cast. Just high clouds passing on through for the weekend. As we get into Monday and Monday night, that's when the next cold front will come through. So in the meantime, soak up this beautiful weather. This is more normal for the end of April versus the end of March. So we'll have 79 degrees on Sunday and we could break the record for that day because the record is 78 for the afternoon. So we'll keep a close eye on that. Otherwise, we'll hit 80 on Monday and chances for showers Tuesday and Wednesday with highs in the 50s.